Hard to be a betting man on this one. These two competitors can be unpredictable. Well, that's what makes this match so intriguing. And guys, I'm pretty sure I can watch these women compete each and every week. Going for the double play with this move. Tie in the face, taking some serious damage here. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Charlotte not in a good spot here. But I'd be surprised if she doesn't find a way back in control of this thing. If you're worried about her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. Oh, man. She can withstand so much more punishment than this. I definitely didn't anticipate her struggling so much, but hey, crazier things have happened here in the double. Ronda Rousey, this is all but over. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Guys, you never know what you're going to see in a match like this. And if you need proof of that, just go back to watch Daniel Bryan versus Kane from Extreme Rules 2014. Ball straight forearm. And now it's Charlotte yeah. getting pushed to the limit. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan carrying Kane back to the ring via a forklift. That's right up there, Michael, but let's not forget it. that was also the... And now the dynamics of this match are about to change, and not in a good way either. Oh, man, she's rolling now. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Here's Charlotte getting ready, guys. That packed a punch. That's what makes her so dangerous. Charlotte's just getting... She's not playing any games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me! Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. Charlotte is in trouble. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. I'll tell you, watching Extreme Rules matches make me happy. My in-ring days are behind me. You talk about a treacherous environment to compete in. Oh, neck breaker. Oh, this is not good at all. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you how many times we've seen Extreme Rules matches result in broken bones, stitches, and even trips to a medical facility. Yeah, but despite all those inherent dangers, these superstars still willingly sign up for Extreme Rules matches. That's what amazes me the most. Real quick reminder, guys, there are no disqualifications and no countouts in this one. Anything is legal. Oh, and there are enough weapons under the ring to fill an armory. Man, this is one of those matches you just like to sit back and enjoy watching. As Corey mentioned, there's a... Ronda Rousey's done playing. Rousey, this is all but over. That's it. That's what she needed.
If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free-for-all where absolutely anything can happen. What a treat we have here with WWE women's superstars in action. I like the way the power bomb through the table. Giving a piece of her mind now. And I'm not so sure she can afford to do that, Cole. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. She clearly liked the results from the first time she delivered that move. There's the Irish whip. I see where she's going with this. Look out. She could be done. Ronda Rousey. This is all but over. That has got to be it. Ronda Rousey, this is all but over. This one is over. Ronda Rousey needs to capitalize on this opportunity. It's rare that a competitor can steal the show in their very first match. But Ronda Rousey did, and that does it. Ronda Rousey captures the win. Extreme Rules is not for the faint of heart, as you can see in these highlights. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match as entertaining and action-filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. There's good, there's great, and then there's downright unbelievable WWE action. Ladies and gentlemen, you just got a taste of the unbelievable. Part. Here is your winner, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. I can't imagine the pain that must have been inflicted by that move. You know, nothing made me happier than when I'd lock in Lucky 13 and make my opponents tap out. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us.